Hey guys, so this is here bringing you another video. Welcome back to Iron to Master. So we return Gold 1, 34 LP, and obviously we lost the last game of Renekton, but it was still a good game. It was educational, we kept positive, and that's what we're aiming for today. I got hiccups apparently. Uh, bringing up the old loaded Meduda. Oh, I'm playing Jin. And as you can see, it's like a mid-platinum game, but there is a duo smurf, and there are 100% a duo smurf. So 44 games, 44 games, same win rate, everything. So this is basically me and Vixie in essence, but like not me and Vixie, but that's the same thing that we're doing. They just got stopped though, so it's not like they're unbeatable. Um, as for the game itself, we're against a pretty good misfortune, but they have low kill, kill participation. This person, Yumi main, we banned them out. And I've always said, and I don't mean to be mean, um, Yumi mains are oh, also worth noting, no one is on their main role on my whole team. Mid main, top main, jungle main, mid main, mid top main. No one is on their actual role. That seems good. Uh, but yeah, again, not meaning to offend people, but Yumi main seem to be the worst players when they're not on their champion. Um, because yeah, Yumi mains don't have to really care about positioning. And then if they're, they're not on Yumi, they suddenly have to care about their own positioning. So yeah. No offense if you're a Yumi player though, but... <laughs> Nah, nah. The Jarvan's account's botted. Yeah, most people that's that do Smurf stuff bot accounts. Again, if you're like, how do you know that? Uh, you just go look at their match history, and before they start playing ranked, they'll just be like in, like, they'll just be in games. That it's like, oh, well, that's not a real game. <laughs> again, if Riot gets a whiff of it, which again, this video, hey Riot, if you're watching, that's a botted account. Um, yeah, they, they get banned pretty quick. It's not worth buying accounts. Again, it, do it literally doesn't take long to level an account. I never get why people would do that. Uh, Twiz, welcome, dude. Oh, no, what? not welcome. Goodbye, dude. <laughs> He's going to work. Have nice time in work. Me speaking Glando well. What's a bot account? Uh, a, a, a script that moves the characters for you that levels it up in games automatically. I don't know if you needed a flash, buddy. All right, that evens up the lane. Speng, welcome to two-year club with his prime. Pengu gives another sub. What are you doing, Pengu? All right, what's the game? So they got Zerath, Jarvan. That's a dangerous combo. But Echo actually is pretty good for dealing with it. Because again, think about it. Jarvan locks someone down and it gives uh, Zerath free shots. Well, Echo's really good at avoiding stuff. One with his E, secondly with his ult. So Jarvan might actually not camp that lane. Even though they're a 100% smurf duo. You know, again... If you've watched already the, 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 the Smurf series with me and Vixie, you can already... Like, I'm not just camping for her. I'm going to the lane that I think is worth going to. Um, so, yeah. Nice. Nice to see Jin gameplay. Yeah, I love playing Jin. I think he's really fun. The problem with the champion, I will say... Uh-oh. That's really bad in top lane, by the way. I'll explain why in a second. Um... The problem with Jin is, like, I think he's one of those heroes, champions, whatever the hell, that is so cool when you're doing well on him. It sucks when you have a bad game because he's got no mobility. So if you're behind, you just die. Uh, but why that's really bad, by the way, yeah, he's running Exhaust Ignite against Fiora. This is a complete all-in, and he lost. Somehow. He didn't use Exhaust, though, which is a bit weird. He used Ignite, but not Exhaust. Unless he towered over? I don't know. Astral! Hey, how's it going? 29 months. Again, one thing I'll say about the community, we're growing all the time on YouTube and Twitch, but I love to see old people. Well, not old people, but like people that have been around for a while. <laughs> it's always awesome to see.
stream overrun by old people. <laughs> Air Ride 101. Nine months of a Twitch sub that says been here since 2015. Yeah, that's a long time ago. Again, I don't even know when I started doing Twitch. Obviously, I did YouTube for a couple of years before I even did any streaming. Oh, Pengu, dude. <laughs> Gives another sub to Kyaomuri, and that's a name I recognize. I'm gonna have to flash. Damn. I actually really wanted to get a kill then. Oh, Echo died in the 1v1. Bummer. Why does no one play Cogmore? Uh, too team reliant for an AD carry in solo queue. Pretty much. This is awkward. Do I just do that? That does not feel good, though. I honestly think I just don't buy anything, pretty much, and just wait till BF Sword. Or maybe... Yeah, that was a heal. Um, I don't know. Maybe. Uh, what other games are you playing, kind of thing? Um, Valorant, pretty much. I can say it here for the YouTube audience. In about a week's time... Uh, by the time this video comes out, maybe just less than a week, it's next weekend. Uh, I'm in a TFT tournament, but it's a charity TFT tournament. All the proceeds and everything is going to, I believe, charities for the certain thing that's going on in the world right now. Again, I can't really say it because I, I, my videos, by the way, on YouTube have been getting demonetized. Um, I don't know for how long for, and I don't know if it's affecting my revenue, but they, they get confirmed by manual review in terms of they get monetized. But they're demonetized for a portion of time. I'm not really sure. Like, my revenue, again, is in the complete toilet right now. But, yeah, that obviously might not be helping. And I think it might be just we're occasionally talking about that certain subject. So, probably going to just call it that certain subject nowadays. If I actually refer to it as its actual thing, I think YouTube doesn't like it. <laughs> it's like, oh, okay. Can't mention what's going on, at the, I guess. Which is a little bit weird. Could do with a gank right now, actually, because we are getting zoned out. Jarvan's been bot lane, was bot lane again, cleared that ward, and we don't know where he is, so... This isn't good. They are slow pushing, though. We just gotta let them slow push to us. Because we could easily get caught here. I like our team fight potential though, by the way. Well, I like our fight potential. Uh oh. Fiddle's not six. Eesh. They shouldn't be taking that fight, I don't think. Yeah, they're both dead. I don't know what's happening with the Echo. He seems to be finding himself in pretty weird positions. This is why I wouldn't do Exhaust and Ignite on Kled. Do one of them. Like, we, we showed that video not long ago of that Kled running Exhaust, and it was actually very effective. Um, but running both of them, it's just a recipe for disaster if it goes wrong. Like, it'll either go amazing, or you're going to feed like crazy. Man. Nah, I was dead anyway, Jarvan was there. Brom took a little bit too much damage at the beginning of that fight for us to win it. That's nice. That's very nice. Well done. Well done. Um, wrong one. Let's do that.
ugh, winnable if the alt landed? Uh, I think I don't. I don't think so. Like I would have killed the pike quicker, but I think Brom would have been dead anyway. And I think Misfortune still beats me in the one v one at that stage. It might have been closer, but I still think I would have lost it. That's Brom ultimate. Damn, I didn't get that kill. Fiddle ult though, that could be huge. Ooh, and Kled ult. Fiddle ult! Hmm. Not going particularly well, yeah. Fiddle didn't have ultimate up. And no, apart, uh, no, oh my god. They went for the Xerath, I think, and he's the one that didn't die. Hey, Vixie. Again, the Kled is, uh, we'll see. He might, like, outscale her in the 1v1. Well, it's a Fiora. Mm. Not sure about that. We don't want the enemy team to get that, and Jarvan already showed that. Why are you so low? I think the enemy team's got Dragon now, by the way, which is a bit annoying. I think it's too late. Close. If Fidda was there, maybe. Damn, it didn't go off quick enough. If I, I wish I didn't go for that one shot on the on the the pike. Should have just been like, oh, he's dead. Should have gone for the Jarvan, I guess. Oh my god, dude! Pengu just gifted ten thousand bits, and he asked, "Do I have a sound for this?" No, I don't. No, I, there we go. Hold well on. I don't have a sound for 10,000 bits. What the hell, dude? From... Wait, what? That hit me? Are you sure, game? Hit him! Yeah! <laughs> oh, Zareth is bot lane. I want to try and save him. Come, come, come. Come! Come! Have I gotten 10,000 before? No. No, I've not. Wait, why is Fiddle not coming? Ah! Okay. That's where tier 2 boots would have been handy. <laughs> How much is 10k? Over $100, I guess. Which is... Um, Brewski as well donated, um, not donated, gave a Prime. My head is just gone at the moment. Um, two months of Prime. Hopefully I can remember to renew my t my uh, sub three months in a row. Thank you so much, dude. Again, that's the annoying thing with Twitch Prime, actually. is a lot of people who have Twitch Prime aren't necessarily even people that go on Twitch that much or log in. Um, and it doesn't auto-renew. I don't know why it doesn't auto-renew. I guess it... Oh, I know why it doesn't auto-renew. It's technically a free sub that comes out of Amazon's pocket because you've got Amazon Prime. So why would they want everybody to be using that all the time? I guess that's probably why. But yeah, if you are watching my YouTube stuff and you have Amazon Prime, you do have a free Prime subscription, which is a tier one subscription on Twitch for free to use every month. Again, you do not have to use it on me, but make sure you do use it on some streamer. And I'd say, feel free to use it on a smaller streamer than me. Um, you know, the smaller streamers, like I can tell you right now, will definitely, you know, appreciate the individual subs a lot more. You know, someone like Summit and that when he has 250,000 viewers or whatever. Yeah, like he doesn't know who you are as an individual. Um, oh man.
Ooh, that pike. I honest, did he even have me with his ult if I didn't heal, by the way? Like, I healed it to make sure, but I don't even know if that got me. It might have been close. Because he knows who I am. I, I will safely say I remember, like, all of my old school subs. And you, you, you surprisingly, you remember quite a lot about them. Um... So yeah. May as well kill the tower. Pike's gone to mid. Nice! Alright, this game is going okay. It's definitely an interesting game so far because it's not a stomp on either side. Definitely either team could win this game for sure. And it's just going to depend on like mid mid game playing who's going to win, which is cool. The double fear is insane. Beast of a player. Welcome, dude. Keep on the nice work, you handsome fish. What? Fish. Handsome. What? <sighs> Life's weird. Alright. We should probably try and get this. But unfortunately, Fiddle, he, again, he used ult. They still got the tower. And it's just before the dragon came up. So maybe... Maybe holding it for the dragon would have been better. I'm not sure. They're on it. They're on it. Dude. Thousand biddies from Pengu. Jarvan? Oh god, that sound. Ree. Fiora? What? 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 I am confused. I am confused. What is going on? Nice. Nice. Alright, we actually signed a snowball. Cool. I for am I looking forward to the volley re rework? Yes, because I've heard he's more different than other reworks have been recently. Auto, auto, get out of the heel. You're dead. Overstay, overstay. Cled did a overstay. He died. He's a pleb. Look out the overstay. No, no. Oh, that fiddle thing scared me. Nice. 
Well, I got red. Hey. Ah. Oh. Hey. 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 Oh. Oh. Hey. Oh, this echo and me are actually working really well together, by the way. Hey. Oh. Let's. Ah. Uh. This spike. What? That missed? Ha <laughs> You flashed! <laughs> what rating is this? Like mid to high platinum. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. If we die now, they get barren. Live! Oh, I can't believe we've done this. That fiddle base was dodgy. Wait, they're not going barren. Are you guys... What? Help? What from? Oh my god, what? What are you doing? What are you doing? What? 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 No, no! Oh, Pike don't look at that. Pike blocked it. Damn, that was a dead Zerathy if he didn't block it. Damn it, dude. <sighs> a summoner has disconnected. He's back. A don't do that to me, Jesus Christ. Ah, damage. Did you see how much damage he did? If the E actually connected, that would have been a dead... Ugh. Oh my god. <laughs> the dragon scared me. <laughs> I got the blue. Alright, let's go do the dragon. Go, 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 ah! I'm dead. <laughs> I was just like, please, don't kill me. I'm dead. <laughs> Bengu, thanks so much for the gifty subby, man. Ah, that, was, that worked out. That's for the greater good. That's, that's greater good stuff right there. I don't mind that death. Oh. Oh, God. That was a per- like, he actually didn't land it perfectly. It was really close. Like, he went just a bit north, then he came, obviously, into the fight. Crows are not better than your owl. Your owl. <laughs> Me and Vixie were playing Valorant, Valorant, whatever the hell it's called, yesterday or by day off. And, like, she's found her strat. There's a hero that has an owl, like, robot that you can send in to get vision. She just presses it and then just hoots in real life. <laughs> Oh, I don't think he had mana. Uh oh. Are they gonna go do Baron? <laughs> Why did you try and flash, dude? <laughs> what? <laughs> well, you dead at that point. Just accept that death. These two are smurf duo. What the hell? Pengu gives another subby. You mad lad. This gin skin is so cool. Does Fiora want some? What's that? Oh, that hit, apparently. Yep, that, that W definitely landed. Mm hmm. Yes. Definitely. What the hell was that hitbox? Oh. 
Oh, God. Alright, we winning this. I told you, this game was good because it was like kind of even in lane phase. And it was just depending who's going to be playing better in mid to late game. And we're just playing better. So, good game. You're back because, like, Twiz is back. You said you were going earlier. And he's like, I'm back. They cancelled work because of a certain thing. I'm not surprised, to be honest. Stay safe, y'all. Stay safe. Any duo today or tomorrow? Uh, we'll be doing it soon, yeah. Uh, maybe Tuesday. Again, I don't know when this YouTube video is coming out. But... You, you poor Jarvan. Echo one-shot the pot. He is 211, but damn. Today's Easter. I mean, people are still working. There's stores still open and Amazon is still delivering here in the UK. Easter, you know, let's not get into whatever's belief in that, but Easter's for a lot of people just a normal day nowadays. Well, it's a day that you eat chocolate. <laughs> it's good. I'm huge. I'm huge. Oh, damn. I need to send my grandparents a text. I was reminding myself. Ooh. Sanka, you're dead. The Almon. Attack, move, attack, move, attack, move, attack, move, attack, move. Attack, move, attack, move, attack, move, attack, move. Where'd he go? I heard money. I will check that momentarily. Uh, let's see. Paul, Paul uh, Vicious donated 10 bucks. Doesn't leave a message. Oh. Thanks very much, dude. Very generous. I missed the last one. Yoinkies. Yoink. Yoink. No. No. Yada! I'm pretty fed. Huh. How did that happen? Again, I play better when I'm just really relaxed and I don't really care. That's good, isn't it? I think I've actually played quite well today. Just the Renekton game, I just got outscaled. This game, Jin doesn't get outscaled by a lot of things. So, there we go. That was fun. That was a good game. Very nice. Very nice. I like that one. Oh, um, I'll give it to the Echo. He played well. Alright, we went 11-3-11. 11, 11, 174 farms, sorry. We got 22, so we're one off promo. And then damage-wise, dealing second most in the game. Yeah, the Echo was doing a crazy amount of damage. Uh, and for him, to be honest... To out damage a Zerath is quite impressive because the Zerath has a crazy amount of poke damage. So that does show how much damage the Echo was dealing because Echo doesn't do poke. He does all in damage. So he was just doing a lot of all in damage. Uh, damage wise though, between the AD carries, we actually do a lot more in our matchup. So that's really good. Um, and that that's probably, yeah, it is of matchup difference. So you can see the Fiora's damage is here. Kled's damage is a bit less. Zerath and Echo, both mid laners, have kind of even damage. But if the difference between the AD carries, I do 6,000 more damage. That's the biggest difference of the two roles, I guess. Well, may maybe jungle, actually. Jungle and AD carry had the biggest differences. Uh, but that's going to be it. Really good game. Hope you guys are enjoying the content. I'm, I'm actually having a really good time at the moment. Last few days have been awesome. But uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, throw a like on the video. Throw a comment, throw a subscribe. See you guys next time. Peace.